What's going on, Vivian? So I made myself the richest person on the face of the earth, and I decided to buy a business. And I'm going to be the best businessman in Fallout 4. But let's just say the uh, results were a bit cursed and messed up, and things didn't really go away the way I hoped. But it's better if I just show you. So yeah, let's begin. All right, let's uh, let's see what we got here. Got a lot of floating stuff. First off, I want to just get rid of all the junk. Well, that closes. That's cool. This opens. Electrons here, okay.
last bridge. That's, yeah, that's safe. Alright, that's cool. Well, that was it. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's, uh... No better way to start my business than to be in debt. And the better way to be in debt, what better way to be in debt is to pay it off than to get a job at the cabin house. Cabin house away. Up yours. I told you to go away. I'm here to talk to Jack Cabot. Even though I got all the keys. Let's go meet the boss. Lead on. Pleased to meet you, Jack. And I am very pleased to meet you. Edward finds it tiresome. But I always like to know personally everyone who works for me. Please, have a seat. How about a drink? Edward, the good bourbon, eh? Hey. You need something, yes? Go check Before that out. Down to business, At once. I have a question I'd like to ask all my new employees. Is this really the time? Don't interrupt Edward. The question is this. Do you believe there is other intelligent life in the universe? 
The universe is a big place. Anything could be out there. Wonderful. Most people's minds are too narrow to admit the possibilities of an infinite universe. But I'm not talking about flying saucers and little green men. I'm talking about the hidden history of our planet. The very origins of human civilization. Ancient powers that modern science, even at its pinnacle, could barely begin to comprehend. That's really interesting. I put my trust in the scientific method, not this pseudo-spirituality. I'm glad to hear you say that. It's become my life's work. My approach is to combine a rigorous scientific method while keeping an absolutely open mind. So much has been closed off to us simply because people assumed they already knew the answers. My father excavated a city in the Rub al Khali in Arabia, which he dated to more than 4,000 years before the rise of any known human civilization. The structures and artifacts were strange, disturbing even, clearly not constructed for or by humans. I've spent my life trying to decipher what he uncovered. Jack, can I tell her what I need her to do? I'm sorry, Edward. I just get carried away sometimes. You're sending her to look for the missing shipment? Yeah. Well then, I'd better leave you to it. We'll talk more about this some other time, when things are less rushed. It isn't important now. Welcome to the family. Okay. You're officially hired. Congratulations. What a whack job. Jack pays the bills. So he can believe what he wants. That's part of the job, by the way. It's best to keep an open mind. Jack may be eccentric, but he's definitely not crazy. The job I got for you is simple. Jack owns a facility north of the city. There's an important package that went missing between there and here. I need you to track it down and bring it back to me. Any questions? Only about a million. You should start at Parsons State Insane Asylum. Don't let the name spook you. It's just the secure building that we're using. We think the courier got ambushed as he was leaving the place. The guards heard gunfire in the distance, but we don't know exactly what happened. Check in with Maria at Parsons. She's in charge of the security force there. She can point you in the right direction. You all set then? I have some questions. Shoot. What's this missing package I'm looking for? It's not all over there. Holding vials of serum. You don't need to worry about what it is. Jack needs it for his research. That's all you need to know. You all set then? How did this package go missing? The courier got there and picked up the package just fine. But never got back here. Could be simple bad luck. Or it could be a deliberate ambush. That's why I'm sending you. It's important that you recover the missing package. Anything else? Nothing else. Okay. They're expecting you over at Parsons, so you'd better get going. Hey. May I be of assistance? What shall we talk about? Your thoughts? I find myself coming inside. I feel so very happy. This is the world. That was it. As you wish. All right. Now we gotta go to the asylum, and I'm not gonna keep me while I have the key already. See you over there at the asylum. All right, we're here. Edward said you might know where to start looking for the package that went missing. Oh, you're the new girl for this package. Pretty sure we know where it is. The guys that shot Ben are holed up in the Parsons Creamery. Just north of here. Why didn't so you handle it? been waiting for me to show up to do something about those assholes. As far as I remember, I don't answer to you. And yet, we were waiting for you. That's your job, to deal with unexpected problems that come up. My job is to make sure nobody gets into this place. That's true. Edward wouldn't have hired me if he thought you could have done the job. Just throw in a lot of attitude for the new gal. I guess we'll see soon. Alright. Talk to Maria. Uh, let's go to the creamery next to Lane Woods for some reason. 
<laughs> All right, here we go. Hey, mysterious serum. Look at this. And I can also sell weapons for money. That was easy. Let's get back to the cabin house. So did you find out what happened to the courier? When do I get paid? We'll get to that. First thing. Hmm. Hardly worth my time. Just a few raiders who ambushed him. Hmm. I don't like raiders operating so close to Parsons. I hope this isn't the start of something serious. What about the serum? There was only this one vial left. Oh, good. I was afraid we wouldn't get any of it back. Here's your pay for the job. I'm throwing a little bonus for bringing back the serum. That was good. No. Sure. Oh, hell. I guess it's time you met Wilhelmina. Jack's not gonna be happy about it. Come on. Sister's even crazier than Jack. Listen, I thought I told you to cut out that kind of talk. I don't know where she's gone, but I can give you a place to start. She's been spending a lot of time in Good Neighbor. At the jazz club there, the third rail. Somebody there must know something. She's not known for keeping her mouth shut. Got it. Off to Good Neighbor then. Uh, we could do that, but I already know where she is because I beat this game twice and three times. So let's go because I'm just I'm in it for money. All right. Welcome, neighbor. We're always glad to see you face around here. Tell me, you have a feel like the whole world is broken. The whole world is broken. That's what I used to think until I found a way to make a difference to transform my life. And maybe everyone else is too. We call ourselves the pillars of the community. We're a pretty new movement, so you may not have heard of us. But we're growing fast all across the Commonwealth, and you can be part of this exciting future. Step right this way, and I'll be happy to tell you all. Sounds good. Well, that's just fantastic. I hope you decide to change your life. I don't mind. You should talk to Brother Thomas about how to join our movement. Right this way, neighbor. Alrighty. I hope you're as excited as I am. 
This is one of my favorite parts of the job, getting to welcome new members into our group. The first step is simple. You have to learn to give up your attachment to material possessions in order to gain the ability to have true wealth. Just go ahead and give me everything you own, and I'll initiate you as the first level four. Oh, no good can come from this. <laughs> You've got to be kidding. You want me to give you everything I have? The first step is the hardest, neighbor. But it's the only way to cast off your old life and start on the road towards your future health, wealth, and happiness. Don't you think that's worth a small temporary sacrifice? What do I get in return for giving you everything I own? You're still stuck in old thinking. Sure. But that's what you came here to give up. And the first step is to shed yourself of your material. Mm -hmm. I'm walking out of here. Your choice, what you want to do about it. Ah, you're not worth the trouble. Plenty of easier marks. Well, you gotta make a business somehow. What the? <laughs> that thing froze! My game crashed, so I'm not gonna do this, so I'm, I'm just gonna kill him. Where is he? Let's change the weather. There we go. You must be Emma G. Don't tell me. Jack sent you. You're Jack's sister? I was expecting someone a bit... younger. You really know how to flatter a lady, don't you? Just to be clear, yeah. I'm Jack's younger sister, the baby of the family. Once I get home and get some of Jack's serum, I'll be back to my usual stunning self. Jack has a serum that reverses aging? It's more like it halts aging. I started taking it when I was 32. So, normally, that's what I look like. You'll see once I get my treatment. I was well known as one of the bells of Boston society. Back when there was any. 
What happens if you don't get more soon? Oh, I don't think we need to worry about that. I've gone without a treatment much longer before with no lasting effect. Actually, there's only one vial of the serum left. Radio's got the rest. I'd better get home before Mother convinces Jack that she needs all of it. That he could still be such a mama's boy at his age is ridiculous. I'm so disappointed in Thomas. He seemed so interesting at first. But after we came here, he turned out to be just another brute. He actually thought it could force me to join his absurd cult. I hope you weren't too attached to Thomas. I was done with him, and he shouldn't have locked me in here. Oh, I'm not going with you. You can tell Mother I'll be along home before too long. I just need to be first. All right. Oh, we're gonna pretty much end that here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the shit like them. Okay. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the shit like, comment, subscribe, ready to see me be a businessman again, or any other challenges you want to see. Let me know down in the comments below. Slice that like button. Hit that like button. Go. Hit that like button. And I'll see you in the next video real soon. Peace.